Windigo Flash Fiction, written and read by Frank Blissett. The dream had come back. It had never really left, he knew, but at least he had not woke remembering it for the past several weeks. The giant, the man-eater, had stepped across the big waters, from his cursed island to the shore in one stride, and had grinned at him a toothy, fetid grin. It gave him an inheritance of seven murders. And then he woke. Dawn was crawling down the little birch copse, turning its whiteness a flushed red. It seemed to him to pulse. The warble of a hundred birds buzzed around him. His stomach throbbed pain through his body. He ate the last of his pemmican, but the knot in his stomach remained. In the distance he could smell the village. Four more and he would become the giant. Four more, and the dreams would leave. That was Windigo Flash Fiction, written and read by Frank Blissett.